Yo, what's good people? Producer Micah here, guys. And today I'm going to be showing you three amazing ways you can play around with your loops and make them yours. If you're new here, kindly hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell notification. So when I post, you guys get to know because, you know, you don't want to miss out on this amazing video. So without wasting time, let's go straight into our DAW, guys, and get started. We're in our DAW and I have these two loops. One is from Waves. I'm just going to solo this. Yeah. So this is basically, if you hear this on any other jam, you'll be like, okay, I've heard this sample before, but I'm going to show you guys how you can, you know, play around with it and tweak it to sound really unique. Then the other one is this drum loop from Sabar Afro Juice Park. I'm also going to be working on this. So let's start with the melody. The first thing I can do, which I've always been doing on my videos, is that I can change the sample rate of this, and I'm just going to edit the sample. Then right-click on, you know, on the sample rate and just change the sample rate. So you, basically you can change it to anything you want, but for me, I just like changing it to 1000 and I just, you know, just accept it. And you know, it, it's just, just the way it just filters the loop. And this is now what we have. So basically now you could build, you could play your own stuff underneath this. So you can send it to your, you know, for your mixer, for example, adding some EQ. So from this, we have this. And I, I love this. I love this. I use this method a lot in my videos. So if you've been watching my tutorials, you know, I, I do this a lot. So just to play around with the sample and make it unique, make it different from, you know, the original that was there. So another thing you can do. So the second method, which you can also do is just to, you know, um, let me send this to my mixer. So I could just add in a um, kickstart. Yeah, so this is another vibe, and I can also do it to this one. So once I filtered it, you know, I can still bring in my kickstart. So I, you can use kickstart for your kick. It's not basically for kick. You can use it for your melodies also. So you can have this. one i love doing for my percussion for example this percussion that i have here i can just send it to my mixer and just use this um there's this plugin called um, frequency shifter so i'm just gonna load that and so i can just play around you can hear how different it sounds so let me turn it off and it's, a, it's an FL Studio stock plugin. So in case you've not tried it out, you can try it out. Frequency shifter. You can use it both on your melodies and also on your drums. So it sounds like this. The another thing I can do for my drum is just, you know, create an automation clip. So go to automate and just create an automation clip for my volume. And... Let me, let me, let me, let me try and add more. So let's see. Another thing you can use is gross beats, you know, you can use gross beats. So let me just go with this. You know, so instead of the conventional, let me just go back to the original vibe we started with. Then with our drum, let me turn turn it off, turn everything. Um, yeah, so then we have this, this vibe, which is kind of, you know, you know, we've played around with the loops. And then let's just turn it off. Wow, 
one, I change the sample rates, you know, from this. Then the other way is that I use gross beats. I, sorry, I use um kickstart. I use kickstart, which um, you can see. And also, you can also reduce the mix. If you feel like it's too much, you can reduce the mix of, mix of the kickstart. Yeah, then the next thing is I use, the third one is I use um, automation. You know, just play around the sample, I use automation. Mixed with um, my frequency shifter. You can play around with that, whatever way you want, you know, just to make it uniquely yours, guys. Yep, so this is just basically three simple ways you can make your sample sound really really interesting and unique so you could try it out and let me know what you guys think if you have any other way you know just let me know in the comment section and i'm really gonna appreciate that thank you guys for watching and you know the vibe guys peace